Greenville, South Carolina is well known for its top restaurants, bustling downtown, and natural attractions. And a great way to experience a bit of it all is to take a ride on the Swamp Rabbit Trail, which runs from downtown Greenville to the funky city of Traveler's Rest. To fully immerse myself in Greenville's cycling culture and downtown scene, I'm starting my ride at the Swamp Rabbit Inn, a bike-friendly B&B just two blocks off Main Street. Local Thai Hawk picks me up with a city bike I can borrow to help me explore the trails. You know, we're downtown Greenville right now, but then we're gonna go through a university, we're gonna go through a small industrial community, and then we'll end up in this town that's been turned around because of the, because of the trail. We wind through the park to enjoy the gorgeous scenery before heading down the trail. Yeah, it's beautiful. I love hearing the sound of the rushing water. Yeah, it's right downtown. Yeah. <laughs> So this is the steepest climb we'll have. And pretty it, uh, flat, pretty flat. Pretty then. flat, yeah. Being on an old rail bed makes it a great trail for everybody. We'll be riding nearly 20 miles to Traveler's Rest. On this part of the trail, you really start to see how it was an old rail corridor, heavy industrial area. But the cool thing is that so many people use the trail for transportation and the lofts right behind us are now full of people that get all over Greenville by riding their bikes. One of the neat things about this trail is that there are lots of stops you can choose to make along the way. So now we're coming into one of my favorite places. This is uh, Swamp Rabbit Cafe and Grocery. Uh, their peach smoothies are incredible. Ooh. And it's just a neat place to come in and, and just hang out with friends. Fresh produce, breads and cheeses are just some of the items you can pick up along the trail. But I'm taking Ty's advice and getting a peach smoothie. Thank you. Back on the trail, we take another detour that's close to Ty's heart. So Ty, we're on your campus now. Yes, I graduated from Furman University. It's just one of these nice little detours that you find along the trail. Campus is so pretty, people come and kind of treat it like a park. I mean, you'll see people out here picnicking or playing disc golf, and it's just a, it's right off the trail, so it's easy to come and, and enjoy a little time on the lake. Our final stretch of trail takes us through pretty forests before we pop out alongside Traveler's Rest where funky shops and restaurants beckon travelers, especially cyclists. Any good trip deserves a good destination, and, and everyone knows you should carbo load after exercise, so let's go get a beer. That sounds great. <laughs> Swamp Rabbit Brewery crafts award-winning beers right on site and is popular with cyclists. I choose the Raspberry White Ale. Cheers. Cheers. And am not disappointed. Ooh, yeah. Exactly. <laughs> Our reward. Yes. <laughs>